Hello and welcome back to the Modern Stacker and in this super quick follow-up video to my uh, video that I posted out Sunday morning uh, which you can find here to see as uh, proof that we actually had this conversation I made a prediction that spot price for silver this week was going to drop to around oh say 2350 or kind of thereabouts below and uh, I would like to just kind of highlight this, do a little victory lap right here. <laughs> it did, in fact, hit it. And again, I wasn't surprised because if it didn't break out here, it was essentially going to go back down. Because what we're in, again, just to recap for those of you who didn't see the video, we are in a descending, broadening wedge pattern. And that me it's a, it's a positive indicator that eventually... Once it breaches this top level barrier, because you can draw these lines here uh, on either side to kind of get your, you know, your upper and lower ranges, and that kind of gives you a trajectory. And if it's a broadening wedge, that's a that's indication that this is a positive trajectory. And eventually, when it hits, you know, it kind of does its little thing. <laughs> Maybe not squigglies like that, but like when it, you know, it kind of does its thing. If it hits this point and breaks through. Then the next time it, it'll maybe do this, it's going to shoot up like that. I mean, that's the that's a typical pattern you see with a descending broadening wedge. So, um, but until it breaks this point right here, it can basically go up and go down and go up and go down and it can go up and down until it finally gets to that point where it's kind of done with that exercise and then it punches through. So when you see it punch through then we're in a new funnel and we're going to have to like you know draw a different set of lines going this way so until that time you've kind of got this range to play with and if it continues to i guess uh, don't do that if it continues to i guess go out like this then you know you, we have this broadening wedge that we can kind of use to kind of guide our you know our forecasting but right now uh enjoy the dip all right, enjoy the dip. And you know, if you're looking at picking up some precious metals, now's a good time to do it. You can see here the price, you know, the MACD is going down, the uh, relative strength index is down. Uh, most likely there's gonna be a correction that's gonna bounce it back up. Um, yeah, so there you go. Anyway, just let me know if you have uh, any feedback in the comment section below. Uh, did, are you gonna take advantage of this? I hope you are, but uh, if you are, you know, brag about it. Let us know in the comments what you're getting. I mean, like, let's, you know, share the love. So, and uh, subscribe to this channel if you want more content like this. If you want to kind of be a little bit more alert to the buying opportunities that are coming, that's what I'm going to be helping you do in the days ahead. So consider subscribing and I will catch you in the next one. Keep on stacking.